Hey everyone, so I know it's been a really super long time since I've done a hair tutorial, and sorry about my hair right now, um, I had it in some braids earlier, so that's why it looks like it's crimped, um, so I just decided to do a hair tutorial for you today, um, this is just a style that I've really been liking my hair in, um, I know a lot of people would disagree, but I'm one that kind of likes the kind of tight and kind of not curls it's kind of difficult to explain but um I kind of like tight curls but um not really super tight but um you will see in this video that my curls that I do with my curling wand um make my hair like a lot shorter than it is so I've already been talking for a minute so let's get started so the first thing that you want to do is take your favorite brush, I'm just using this one by Conair, and I'm just going to brush my hair out completely from root to tip to make sure there's no tangles or not. And my hair is like super knotty, so yeah, sorry, sorry if this step takes a while. Super naughty hair, but it shouldn't take too long. So, yeah. Alright, so now I am done brushing my hair, and now I am just taking my, um, my rimming pin clipless curling wand. I got this for Christmas and um I showed this in my January um no not in my January favorite. My um best of two thousand eleven favorite. Oh my gosh. Um in my best of two thousand eleven favorite. So yeah, I mentioned it. And I just have it on the set in between fifteen and twenty. And I think this is the half inch one. I'm not really sure because it makes really tight curls. But um, I think it's a half inch one. But so, yeah. That was weird. But so, yeah. Um, I'm just going to take um, little sections. But um, first, there's um, a certain way that I like to um, put my hair while I'm doing it. I like to separate it into two pieces um, so they don't get like mixed together and stuff, but then the side of the star on this is the side, I'm going to split into two pieces, um, two pieces, and then like this part, I want it to be smaller, so you know I am curling my bangs, and I'm going to put the rest behind me, so yeah, so this is how I put my hair when I curl it, and what you're going to do is you're going to put the curling on right under the hair, Okay, and then you're basically just going to wrap it around the wand. Now what I like to do is I like to point it down because it makes better curls. So I'm just going to hold it to, to the um, wand about 8 seconds. And then you're just going to let it go. And it makes this really cute um, girly curl. So then you're just going to take another section of hair, and you're just going to do the same thing. And you're just going to hold it there for like 18 seconds. So, just some kind of curl. Oh, and I forgot to do this. Um, but while I um, to hold the curl, I use my Aussie Awesome Volume Spray Gel. And I just spray this very, very lightly on the curl. Um, because this tends to um, make your hair very hard. Very lightly, and then I'm just going to take 
take the next piece and continue doing this. And you want to be very, very careful about this. I don't have a glove, so it becomes dangerous. So yeah. And it just makes these super nice curls. I don't know how to fast forward this. So, yeah. Gosh, it keeps coming loose. So, yeah. Um, I'm not going to be doing this whole video because that would make this video super, super, super long. Um, so, I'm probably just going to cut this short because you get the idea. Um, oh my gosh. Look at that. Like, I just did this separate. And it made me super, super, super tight curl. Um, I might do a part two to this video. Um, just so you can see what it looks like when it's finished. But I need to curl that part again. Um, so yeah, that's just what the first curls look like. I'm gonna do a part two. So yeah, I'm just gonna. Yes.